Coffee Country and Cody all over the world right now on 6:50 a.m. WSM, WSMonline.com, our app download, and Circle TV Country plays here. And you say country, you're looking at it. You're looking at country. <laughs> There's Kaylee Hammock. Wasn't Loretta Lynn your first ever concert that kind of sent you on your way? You said, I'll never be the it, same after seeing this. It was. And I actually just watched Coal Miner's Daughter the other day, um, about two days ago, and tried to relive my childhood through it. Yeah, Loretta <laughs> Lynn was my first concert. Well, since you and I last talked on Coffee Country and Cody, you are an ACM award winner as we sit here. And <laughs> you get to share that with some very special people in your life. Tell people about the musical event of the year, Fooled Around and Fell in Love, Miranda Lambert, and how you girls came to be a part of it. It was just a random idea Miranda had um, to bring all of us in and get us to sing a cover, something that shaped all of us, something from our childhoods. And uh, she wanted to do it every single night. At the end of the show for the encore, we all would get on stage together and we'd sing it together. And it was a musical event that happened many, many times last year. And um, every single time it was just as enjoyable as the last. But we all got in the studio with Jay Joyce and uh, we sang this old Elvin Bishop song and uh, did a female version of it and really enjoyed <laughs> it. All of us just singing together, getting harmonized with one another and harmonizing and working with people that I look up to so very much. And then getting to know them and realize that they're just as genuine and as wholehearted as their music and man I've always been scared to meet my idols you know it's always that age-old thing of if you're excited to meet someone they're probably going to be a jerk to be honest the thing is in country music it has not happened yet every single person I've got to meet and Miranda Lambert is kind of the flagship of them all she has just taken me under a wing and been so good to me and to connect all of us in that song even if it hadn't won an award it was just such a blessing do you realize as we sit here, today marks the date, 17 years ago, that Miranda Lambert signed her record deal on Epic? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Man. And it, she, she's won 35, not been nominated for, but won 35 Academy of Country Music Awards. No big deal. But you know what? The coolest thing about that woman is... I mean, she'll still invite you to the farm and jump in her pond with you. That is that is genuine country to me. It's not only can you win 35 awards, but you can stay as humble and as grounded as you were when you were a kid. Now, that's something special. What did you learn from touring with Trisha Yearwood on that Every Girl Tour, speaking of idols and things that brought you to this award-winning point in your life? I learned a lot about cooking, to be honest, from Trisha. Um, <laughs> I learned a lot about designer. She uh She's been real good to me and was like, well, you need to look up this person. You like shoulder pads? I can show you shoulder pads. Uh, it was such it's such a wonderful time to be with her on the road and also on the cooking show. And um, man, right now I'm trying to grow something for Trisha Yearwood. Uh, I'm trying to grow her a loofah, Mr. Cody. That sounds weird, I know. But did you know that you can grow loofahs? I did not know this. I am learning every second that we speak here. So All I'm planning is to grow a loofah for Trisha Yearwood because I told her about it when we were on the road, and she goes, well, I want one. And so this year I am just waiting on bated breath for these loofahs to grow so I can give Trisha Yearwood one. So, so what is a loofah for our audience who may not know? <laughs> I know, I know, it sounds silly. Um, but a loofah, you know, the sponges you have in the bathroom that uh, I used to think they were some type of sea organism, but it is a gourd you can grow in your garden. So I am growing one for Trisha Yearwood, you know, a bath sponge, because that's exactly what you give your idols. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> so, sometime when you have more time, I'm sitting here thinking somewhere between culture and agriculture is one of the themes we use on the show. It works perfectly here. And Reba McIntyre, another great woman in country music. I guess she's hosted the ACMs more than anybody, although Keith Urban hosts this year. Um, how did the two of you finally come together? I mean, that's every girl's dream, redheaded girl. Oh, yeah, you know it. It was a manifestation. It was God, really, and my manager, Mary Hilliard. Uh, I think both of them were working on it, but I, it was just a big wish of mine to have one day, you know, years from now, maybe, when Reba knew who I was, um, maybe she would want to do a remix of Redhead, one of the songs I put on my record that was inspired by a redheaded cousin of mine. And um, I told my manager that, and she laughed and said, well, who knows, but you know what, I may just say something about it to her manager. 
Well, her manager heard the song and said, well, I'll play it for Reba. And Reba wrote back and said, well, just tell me what lyrics and I'll sing it. And uh, I almost died that day, <laughs> but um, just from the shock of it all. But she has just been, I mean, she is a beautiful mixture of a human being. She is a businesswoman. She's so savvy and on her toes all the time. But then she has this warmth about her that when you meet her, it almost feels like you're meeting a second mama or something. Having known her when she was your age in this business, I see that you share a lot of qualities with Reba McIntyre. So it must be a redhead thing. Oh, thank you. That is a big, big compliment, <laughs> Mr. Cody. I appreciate that. You bet, Kaylee. Thanks for joining us from the Academy of Country Music Awards, Kaylee Hammock. I'll see you next time. You're on 650 AM WSM, WSMonline.com, our app download and circle television. Country plays here. Kaylee Hammock is country, y'all. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.